Southland beekeeper Jeff Scott burning his beehives because they're infected with American fowl brood bacteria, or AFB for short. While only laboratory testing can give a definitive diagnosis, a good field test is the dead larvae being distinctly sticky. Fowl brood also has a smell which experienced beekeepers can often detect. Infected hives have to be burned and buried within 24 hours of finding evidence of the bacteria. And Scott says it's heartbreaking for beekeepers having to destroy the beehives they've looked after so carefully. Devastating, you're caught. In fact, a fellow at Winton that had hot earth described it as like a loss in the fam- death in the family. Over the past year, nearly 3,000 infected hives have been reported across New Zealand, with just 87 in Southland. Because of the risk of spreading AFB to other hives, all of Scott's hives in the affected area have been quarantined for 18 months, with queen bees not being able to be sold on, and while the honey's okay to eat, it can't be sent away for processing. If I mix the honey supers up from an AFB hive to one of the other hives, then I'm going to spread AFB to that hive as well. So I can't even send it to an extraction plant, because that could transfer through to other beekeepers' gear and stuff. He's concerned some beekeepers might ignore the fact their hives are infected. There's a lot of ignorance around it and there's um, a lot of people that won't want to admit they've got it, which is the saddest part. Um, And there'll be people that'll try and hide their hives. The Southland Bee Society are hosting a meeting next Wednesday to help people learn about the disease, including how to identify and deal with it. The society is also offering to check hives for free. We're going to have this open meeting in July, so anyone that's got a beehive with a registered knot can come along and learn about it. Hopefully we can we can deal with it and get back to being zero tolerance, like zero hives again in Southland. The Southland Bee Society's meeting is set to be held at the Don Street RSA on the 17th of July. And in Invercargill, for the South Today.